Hi, I'm Jason Mears and this is Windows Server 2019 Initial Configuration, part of the vSphere 7 Home Lab series. So on a cleanly installed box or a newly installed box, it's going to do a couple of things like enable remote desktop so we can RDP to this box or remote desktop connection to this box using the terminal services client. I'm also going to change the IE enhanced security configuration. So this is um, removing the enhanced security configuration for Internet Explorer in a home lab environment. This is OK to do. I don't have any um, uh, corporate data or personally identifiable information. You may want to consider this if you're in a corporate environment, but for a home lab, that uh, reduced IE security um, tends to make things a little bit easier. And I've just gone there to the Windows Update settings. Um, and we're going to do uh, Windows updates and then restart the host. It's a good idea to keep going back to that Windows updates um, setting and make sure that all applicable updates are installed. And it'll take a while but it will eventually restart. And we're going to log on as the uh, domain administrator. Joining the domain is covered in a, in a in a different video. What we'll see here now is when we get back to server manager. So everything looks okay here, um, and we've checked for updates. We'll just check again. And if there's anything, it will catch up with them. But essentially, we now should be up to date with a patch server with remote desktop enabled and the IE security settings dropped slightly just to make it easier to use in a home lab. So that was the server 2019 initial configuration, part of the vSphere 7 home lab series. I hope you found that useful and thank you very much for your time.